Howdy friends! Welcome to the vlog or welcome back. If this is your first time here, we are so happy to have you. We're happy to have you if it's not your first time here as well. I'm Sarah, my husband's Josh. This vlog is just a little bit of our adoption journey. We are currently in the process of adopting from China. So each vlog, I'll try to kind of give you either an update of what's going on in that process or some like little tips and tricks about the adoption journey. Um, and then I will show you a little bit of life and what's going on. So thank you so much for being here. We're glad that you've decided to join us as our adventure continues. Last time I saw you, um, it was our international market haul video. I was so excited about vlogging. I was gonna do this on a more regular basis. I was like ready to go. However, um, in the course of those few weeks, allergies got me. And y'all, they knocked me on my butt this year. I have just been so out of it. Um, so it kind of put vlogging on the back burner. My initial goal was like, okay, I'm gonna do a new vlog every week. And then that week came and went and I was feeling horrible and I'm like, um, okay, I'll do one every other week. I'm sorry. I want to get like on a regular schedule. I do truly enjoy this and I want to make it a habit. Um, I think I'm on the other side. Let me rephrase that. Today is a great allergy day. So I'm going to take advantage and make a vlog. Josh's parents are actually getting into town this evening. Yay! We only see them every three months or so, but they're on their way and they're coming and we're so happy. They're on their way. We have all kinds of fun stuff planned for this weekend. We're gonna make the best of it and really just hanging out and drinking coffee and tea and talking is going to be good for our souls. Segwaying back into my allergy dilemma, um, because of allergies, my house, I have not been cleaning it the way that I should be and the way that I want to be. So yeah, we're going to be taking a couple hours today and doing a bit of a mad clean. Actually, this is like crazy embarrassing, but if you look right here, that's a dust bunny. Uh-huh. Yeah. I have animals, y'all. I have not been sweeping and vacuuming as diligently as I need to be. So we're going to be dealing with said bunny back there. I think I had to bust out my real vacuum for this half of the house. It's, it's yeah it's not gonna work off the Roomba I am going to try to fill you in on a little bit of adoption stuff I have a grants video that I'm working on putting together as far as like how to apply for them to give you some more details on them um, so that is in the hopper and coming very soon um, but for today it's just gonna kind of be what's going on in life at the moment can you guys see the pollen well this pollen is what's trying to kill me you guys see it it's ridiculous Spring, I love you, but I kind of hate you. It's now 12.45. I got the kitchen mopped, I got some stuff cleaned up. I got 15 minutes to vacuum like this half of the house. So, fastest vacuuming ever. I've done as much cleaning as I'm going to do. I vacuumed, I swiffered, I cleaned all of the counters and stove in the kitchen, I cleaned the bathroom, I made guacamole, um, yeah. Oh, I dusted, I did a lot. And now I look like a hot mess. Let's freshen up a bit, shall we? There we go, that's a little bit better. Hey everybody, future Sarah here. I apologize in advance for my robo voice in this next little portion of video. I'm editing today and I realized, wow, I sounded like a computer when I recorded last night, but I was honestly really tired. Also, super sorry that Josh wasn't in this vlog more. The weekend just kind of 
it was great, but it was really busy. And uh, yeah, Josh will be in the next one more. I know he's definitely the funnier, more funny, funnier. He makes the vlog more lively than I do. So I promise he will be more involved in the next one. So I give you Robo Sarah. Thanks y'all. It's Sunday evening, you guys. We had a lovely visit with Josh's folks. It was fast, but it was refreshing. As far as the adoption goes, we did reach out to our agency to ask about a timeline from here on out. Uh, when we first applied for adoption, they said it would take about six months for a referral file. However, with COVID, everything is literally topsy-turvy. And our agency said they have no idea how long it could take. There are 3,000 files out there right now on various agencies waiting children lists. So over the next coming weeks, we'll scour those waiting children lists while we hope and pray that more files will be created and released sometime soon. Um, please continue to join us in praying that that referral will happen sooner than later. And also please continue to pray that travel will open. There are so many families that are ready and matched and would just want to go pick up their precious little ones. And uh, so please pray along with us that travel will open soon and that it'll be safe for all parties involved. Thank you guys so much for joining us. And until next time, the adventure continues. Bye. <music>